it's a dark place Ain't no right way, just the wrong way, I know I problem solve with style Sir, man, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Tavo coming back here with another video, man. Today I got y'all with the best Pierce Sharpshooter build on NBA 2K21 Next Gen, man. I ain't gonna lie, this is the, really the best one I've ever seen so far. Like, so far, this is the best Pierce Sharp build for all my Pierce Sharpshooters out there, bro. I'm talking about you got a good height, a good wingspan, you got everything you need, you got speed, you can do it all, bro. I ain't gonna lie. But let's get right into it, though. So, you wanna be a point guard, right? A point guard, man. All my passionate Pierce Sharpshooters out there, bro, you're finna be going crazy on next year when you get the console, bro. Now look, bro, you wanna be a point guard, any hand, any jersey, it doesn't matter. For your height, you wanna go 6'5", right? You wanna go 6'5", look, lowest weight, bro. You wanna be as fast as you can since you're a Pierce Sharp and you're 6'5". Then your wingspan, look, you wanna go 6'10", bro. This is gonna get you your, your 95 dunk. You're gonna have contact dunks, bro. Every contact dunk, you're gonna have them. You can still speed boost. You got good defense. You got everything you need to go crazy. For your body shape, you can really go with anything, man. It's really up to you, bro. I, I'm gonna just go with Bill just to go with it. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> now for your attributes, bro. The fun part of making the build, try to balance out enough. Since you're a pure sharp, you know what I'm saying? You don't need a lot of finishing. You don't need too much playmaking, but you still need a decent amount. But you want to have like at least like 10 or more defensive badges. And I got the perfect build for y'all off with shooting because shooting is the most important on this build right so look max out your midi i already did it max out your midi max out your three pointer and upgrade your free throw to a 76 bro 76 is the perfect amount for this build it's gonna leave you with 25 shooting badges look you got everything hall of fame you know what i'm saying there's no way you're missing out there bro with a 95 three pointer and 25 shooting badges so look at 99 you're gonna have a 99 three-pointer bro a 99 three-pointer with 25 shooting badges bro i'm telling you you should not be missing bro you should not be missing now look for finishing you want to have your driving dunk at a 92 right a 92 you're still gonna get all the contact dunks a 92 is the limit right you don't need 95 92 is perfect for you bro when you hit 99 you'll be able to get a 90 um 96 driving dunk so you're gonna be chilling bro so look your driving lip, you want to make it a 69, and then your close shot, you want to make it a 47, bro. This is going to leave you with four finishing badges. Y'all see, I can get Posterizer Hall of Fame, bro. And I ain't going to lie, the only reason I'm putting this on the Pierce Sharp is because this is the game this year, bro. It's dunking and shooting, bro. That's that's literally this game. Every build can dunk and shoot, bro. You do not want to have a build that won't be able to get contact dunks because then you're just at a, like, a negative. And everybody else could dunk on you, bro. You want to be able to dunk on people too, bro. Now look, man, for your playmaking, you want to have an 89 ball control, so just max it out. Your speed with ball, max it out. You got to be quick, you know what I'm saying? And then your pass accuracy, you want to make it a 66, and this is going to give you 13 shooting badges. Now look, you're a pure sharp, man. You're a pure sharp. You do not need 18 to 20 shooting badges. You don't even need, like, 15 to 20 like, all you need is 13 badges. I'll show y'all how to put the badges on too, bro. Like, I'll show you what exactly, like, you need for this build. Close attention right here, bro. Look, interior defense, you want to max it out. No, not max it out, but you want to make it a 62, right? A 62. Sorry if I mess up, bro. I'm reading this from my phone right now because I can't remember this off the top of my head. Like, it's too much into this. It's complicated, bro. But look, perimeter defense, you want to max that out. You do not want to touch your steal or block, right? You want to come down to your offensive rebound and get 77 right here and get 54. And you're going to have 10 defensive badges, right? Y'all see that? 10 defensive badges. Now the rest, y'all see, you're only at 87 out of 95. So you can really go crazy on your physical, bro. You can really max out your speed. Acceleration, you can max it out. You can take down your strength because... Actually, you could take down your strength just a little bit. You want to have your interior defense at a... 61 yes yeah, 61 you do not need 62 for interior defense put it down to 61 so you can get the finesse for the extra um attribute point right then you want to max out your stamina to like however it could go to and then oh we still got more so yeah you can put it back up to 62 if you want to man but uh, that's the bill right there y'all see y'all still got a 93 stamina 92 speed 92 um acceleration you got a 70 vertical so you can start really dunking on people you know what i'm saying you can really dunk off rip too you got a 92 contact well yeah you still got contact dunk, but you got a 92 driving dunk 
You know, so you got all the dunk packages, all the contact dunk packages, uh, posterizer Hall of Fame. You got every Hall of Fame suit and badge. And yeah, man, I'm finna show y'all how to set up your badges with this build. Now look, for your takeover, obviously you're a sharpshooter. So you want limitless range. And for the second one, you can go wherever you want, bro. If you want to be able to help your team on defense, bro, choose lock badge. If you want to, like, still be on offense and just go crazy with the phase, you're not saying choose the phase. So I'm going to just go ahead and choose a random one. I ain't going to lie. I can't even see right now because my phone is in front of my screen, bro. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and just choose a random one. And y'all see it, man. You got a pure sharpshooter right here. You know what I'm saying? You, you can really go crazy with this build. Like, this build is not that bad. I ain't going to lie, bro. Now look, man. We're going to get it cracking. I'm going to show you how to exactly put on the badges, right? Now look. All your finishing. Just go straight to posterizer. That's all you need in this game if you're going to drive. But that's all you need. I'm telling you. Now look. You could get everything on Hall of Fame here. Look, look. Hot Zone Hunter. Hot Start. Green Machine. Dead Eye. Uh, what else do you like? What else do you need? Like, <laughs> I don't really know what else to get. Like, this is really all you need to shoot in this game. Oh, yeah, deep threes. I almost forgot about deep threes. But after you get deep threes, I mean, you can really go with whatever you want here. You can go with blinders. You know, I say you can make blinders uh, gold and then just get like something off silver. So it's like evenly. Like, you can get Tyler's shooter. You can do whatever, bro. You have a lot of badges to go crazy with. Now, look, for playmaking, look. You want unpluckable bronze right here, right? Just for now, you want the pluckable bronze. You want handles for days, Hall of Fame, quick first step gold. You want quick first step um gold, bro. Because you're never going to be driving like that. So you just want it gold. Now your bailout, you want it at least silver. Uh, You still got three more. You can put on space crater. You can put on dimer. You know what I'm saying? But I would probably make this Hall of Fame and then like go with like dimer silver. Something like that. That's a good setup. And for defense, you know what I'm saying? This is what you want for defense. You want your clamps, Hall of Fame. You want... You can put on Tyler's Defender on Silver, Pogo Stick, Gold, and like, now you can probably just do this right here. I ain't gonna lie, you do not need a lot of defensive badges this year, bro. You do not need a lot. That is the Pure Sharpshooter build. As y'all know, Pure Sharps are here for one thing, and that's to shoot the ball. So, you can't be comparing them to like, playmaking shot creators, well, not playmaking shot creators, but you can't be comparing them to these demigod builds, bro, because... Pure Sharps are just here to shoot the ball, but in this game, you know, like, you can really play defense, you can still dribble with this build, you can get contact dunks, so you can still go crazy. Hey, but that is the build, man. If y'all enjoyed, make sure I go ahead and leave a like, sub, sub, notify for more videos, man, and I'll see y'all in the next one.